Hi everyone, I am Sobin from Inventor Solutions. Today I will demonstrate about how inventory valuations are handled in ODVRP. Inventory valuation refers to how you value your stock. It is the most important aspect of a business since it can be the biggest asset of an organization or a company. Costing methods you can use to value your stock are first in first out, average costing and standard costing methods. So let us have a look on how to configure these costing methods. Okay, for checking the configuration, we need to go to inventory. Then in the product categories, we are setting the costing methods. So uh, currently I will take uh, one category. And in this I have selected first in first out and inventory valuation is automated. Also the stock properties is set by default. So now I will create a purchase for my product which is already matched to this category. I will select the vendor and add my product. and confirm my order so once the order is confirmed now I will create the bill and here I can add the bill date so once the bill is created we can check in uh, balance sheet So now it's actually empty. I will post the bill, confirm the bill and post it. So at that time itself, we can find that in current assets using stock interim received, the amount will get debit in the account. So once I do the delivery for the purchase I will receive the products and validate this received so at this time we can notify that the stock interim received account will get balanced to zero and stock valuation account will get debited with that amount so now what we will do I will make a sale related to this product I'll select my product and I will sale out by quantities and confirm the sale and I will create my invoice. So once the invoice is created and when I post the invoice at that time we can check in accounting the reflections. Okay, now we can check the reflections. So we can see that in stock interim delivered against the partner, that amount got credited. So now once I go to the sale, and do the delivery I'll validate the stock 
So at this time we can see that The stock interim delivered will get balanced to zero and then this from the stock valuation the corresponding amount will get credited based on the purchase price so in this way we can easily manage our uh, first in first out method for our stock also the corresponding re reflections will be coming in the sales account and expense accounts thank you and have a nice day